Well, my name is Lipsio Carvalho and I'm the CEO of Bitnik & Sons. Bitnik & Sons is an ethical fashion brand that sells backpacks, handcrafted backpacks made in Brazil. Before COVID, uh, Bitnik & Sons was just launching here in Canada, so we started selling in September of 2019. So by the time the, the pandemic uh, uh, hit the country, uh, we were starting to get the first traction for the company and being a company that sells backpacks and travel goods uh, we were hit hard by the pandemic. The first thing that we did uh, in the company was to become closer of the sales operation. So measuring sales uh, on a daily basis was even more important uh, in the first days of COVID-19. Uh, by April uh, unfortunately, we decided to shut down the company temporarily. So from April up until August, the company uh, was permanently shut down, uh, basically on two main reasons. First one, cost of acquisition of our products was super high. And the second reason was that uh, people were just not buying backpacks because they had nowhere to go. So we had to wait until everything started to come back to normal. And that was August. By the month of August, we decided to resume operations and start selling in Canada once again. August was a, a, a month that we did fairly okay, but uh, we switched our focus instead of aiming at uh, North America as a whole, we concentrated uh, our investment mainly in Canada uh, and starting to sell a specific line of products that we found that would be uh, easier to sell and we guarantee a better traction in the first months. And the results started to, to appear, the results started to show up. August was a fairly good month, September was better than August and we were facing a 20% increase uh, on sales for October. So we are very hopeful that November will be an even better month for, for results and for beating and and hopefully the, the COVID crisis is already past gone. And for the future, the plans are just to get back on track and we are aiming to get uh, to scale up and sell more bags and conquer Canada for good uh, uh, in 2021. So everything we're doing now is a preparation for next year. So we're still measuring results again, we are starting over uh, uh, to make 2021 everything that we hoped for 2020.